There's a lot of buzz surrounding Spider-Man No Way Home right now. Recently, quite a few Sony Twitter accounts have changed their cover photos to support Spider-Man No Way Home, and this was soon after changing them to Venom Let There Be Carnage. And then there's also quite a few insiders who are abuzz with claims that Maguire and Garfield are going to be part of MCU Spider-Man's third movie. On top of all of this, however, there has been a recent revelation about the crew that will be working on the VFX for Spider-Man No Way Home. The thing about these crews is that they have brought on quite a few members and supervisors that worked on Sam Raimi's Spider-Man and Mark Webb's The Amazing Spider-Man. So, the incorporation of these teams that worked with past Spider-Men may be a clear sign that those who intimately knew both McGuire and Garfield's Spider-Men are back to share their knowledge for the possible multiverse mashup. After all, who better to work with these past Spider-Men than crews that know how to work with their acting style, as well as the style of Spider-Man that they are. And after all, because as it has been said, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So it sounds like the VFX teams are going to try to match the styles of the Spider-Man movies even if they enter into the MCU, giving us three different feelings for each Spider-Man to bring together what we saw in the past in this new version. And again, along with this news, as I said before, quite a few insiders are claiming that for sure, Maguire and Garfield are in Spider-Man 3. And this may be revealed sooner rather than later, as the main Spider-Man No Way Home Twitter account did tease us with a fake Spider-Man trailer. While this trailer was nothing more than a picture of a semi-truck with the movie title on it, it could mean that really soon we will be seeing a real trailer for the most anticipated Marvel movie to release this year. After all, before they did finally release the name, they did give us a few fake ones from the main stars of the movie. So this could mean that very soon, following these cruel jokes, that we will get a real trailer that finally reveals what we've been hoping all this time. And all these recent revelations and changes to the official accounts may be a good indicator that we will soon be getting a first look at this movie. So, all of this gives us more and more hints that everything we want to see in this next Spider-Man entry will finally come true. But do you think this means anything, or is it all just smoke and mirrors? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and then like this video and subscribe to The Marvelous Wave to assemble and join our team, and have a great day.